I'm interested in science. I think it's really cool that like there's a whole other world out there that's like microscopic that you can't see and it has like a lot of possibilities to find new things that you wouldn't normally see in life. What I'm most excited about with the Fold Scope project and, and our team is most excited about is that the kids will have an opportunity to do hands-on lessons from home as opposed to just sitting and listening or reading or watching videos on the internet. The Foldscope is a compact paper microscope that can connect to your iPad. Um, we're using it to collect samples. So far we've collected a water sample to look at protozoa and an onion membrane to look at the cells. It's actually really impressive how well this small microscope works. They give you some glass slides and also paper slides and some things to like put water inside if you're using a water sample. Once a student has their specimen on the slide, uh, they open the back of the fold scope and slide the slide into this funny little channel on there, close it up, and then it's really kind of funny to watch them up, looking up at the light and trying to get it focused. And um, it's a challenge, but it was a lot of fun. Mr. Davis' teaching is really fun and innovative because he's um, finding new ideas and ways to get us to learn without being in the classroom. He encourages like curiosity, so you can do like whatever you want and further your experiments too. My passion for teaching comes from the fact that I'm incredibly competitive, and um, no matter what I do, whether I'm skiing, playing cards, riding my bike, um, walking around the block with my wife, I'm incredibly competitive. Um, but the my inspiration, honestly, for teaching, uh, it, case in point, is last week I did a question with my students about. Give me something little that's big, and they gave me the best answers. Like the simple fact that a uh, student said a smile, because you, it's something really small, but it could be really important to somebody else. And then one of my students said, me, because I'm tiny, but I have the ability to affect, affect people's lives in a really big way. And um, another student said words, um, because words can, you can do so much with words, whether it's good or bad. And, and when you get that kind of feedback from kids, it's hard not to be inspired.